Hi there. So you're interested in the juice cleanse. That is awesome. That's super cool. Now, there's a couple of um, reasons, though, why a juice cleanse not, might not be right for you. So first off, if you are constipated, if let's say you have a little bit of IBS and you get diarrhea and then all of a sudden you're constipated for a few days or you don't go poop, you know, you go poop every four days or so. Um, if you're experiencing gas and bloating as well, like a lot, then it's not a good idea to do a juice cleanse because those types of issues in the GI can be highly due to a cold digestion and so our digestion needs to be warmed so that everything is moving. The pipes have to be moving and flowing in order for you to be able to be strong enough to do a juice cleanse. A juice cleanse or juicing is essentially for those who you're pooping every day, okay? You're feeling good. If you have diverticulitis, um, diverticulosis, or Crohn's or anything like that, some IBS, as long as you're not experiencing the inflammation parts of diverticulitis when you're experiencing the inflammation or you don't have a bout in Crohn's, you know, if you're it's in sort of a maintenance period at the time and you're feeling really good, then it can be okay for you. But what I suggest you do is definitely be very mindful of it. In cases like diverticulitis, for example, if you're juicing, and you don't have a juicer and you decide to use a, a, a blender, well, you're gonna get the fibers, the insoluble fibers from the vegetables and they tend to be very scratchy. They don't digest well. And so we really need a strong digestion to be able to digest them. But if you're in a diverticulitis where you're actually inflamed, it can really aggravate. And so we don't wanna aggravate, right? So the main thing is, if you are constipated, then juice cleanse is not a great idea. If you experience gas and bloating all the time, bloating every time you eat, not a good idea. All of those indications point towards a weak agni and meaning a weak digestion. So our digestion needs to be nice and strong. And so maybe you're not sure. Maybe you're like, well, I don't know if my digestion is weak or not. So send me a message and we can have a chat and we can kind of gauge a little bit about what's going on with you, right? And it's not to say that maybe you couldn't, you know, have breakfast, have supper and have a couple of juices during the day to cool down during the day. You could do kind of, kind of like a partial juicing, right? Which is still fine, which will still be beneficial, which can still help to cool down the body, which can still have to support the liver and decrease inflammation and all of that. But you may, it might be a better idea to get some food in, in different areas of the day. So all that being said though, you know, think about it for a moment, notice how it feels for you, send me a message and we can have a chat and we can decide and kind of just chat about it essentially. Okay. That's all for this little one. So have an awesome day and if you're cool, we will be juicers. And even if you are not cool, no, you're cool. I, I don't know. Now I'm just rambling. Okay, bye. <laughs>